Today um, we are here for another My Year 2017 video. This is my week for teaching in September and our prompt this month is it's all about you, it's all about me. I, of course, as I've stated at the beginning of the week, I'm taking it as a question. Is it all about you or is it all about me? Um, and thinking of it in the terms of Am I the kind of person that is constantly only thinking of myself and putting myself first, or am I constantly putting other people first and neglecting myself? Because neither one of those is good. You need to have a balance between the two. So today we're going to do a little space for a doodle. And I'm going to do a little doodly frame. I'm going to walk you guys through it. I've got just a plain Bic crystal pen. I've got, uh, which is my favorite black pen, just plain old Bic crystal pen. Um, a Uniball Signo white gel pen, favorite white gel pen. And this one's almost dead, so I, I have another one somewhere. Um, uh, one of my favorite um, crayons, which is a Bible gel high glider. This one is the purple. And my favorite paint pen on the planet, which is a Krylon 18 karat gold leafing pen. Love this pen. Okay, so we're going to do something with those, I think. What we're going to do is we're going to create like a little box or a frame. In that little box or frame, I want you this month, if you mostly think of yourself first and not other people, then I want you once this month to do something that it doesn't have anything to do with you, that doesn't, um, you're not getting accolades for, um, you're not getting praise for, maybe people don't even know that you did it, um, something nice for someone else. If you're the kind of person that's always doing for others and never doing for yourself, then I want you to go out and do something nice for yourself for once. Go out and have a pedicure, have a spa day, buy that favorite art supply you've been wanting, go get some alone time and just read a book and tell everybody, I'm sorry, I can't help you. Um, if you have to get out of the house and go to the park to do that or something, just time for yourself. Go hang out with your girlfriends, something for you. All right, and then inside the little box that we're gonna create, I want you to journal about that. Maybe it's gonna be a big page and you wanna do the whole page. Um, maybe you feel like you have a good balance. So then I want you to journal about that, how you keep your balance. And if you have tips to share with everybody about how you keep the balance in your life, then by all means, if you're filling up to it, share in the group, because I think that's a great thing to do for this month, a great topic, and it sort of has to do with our journaling. So I'm gonna tell you right now, it's okay. <laughs> all right, so we are gonna start with the black pen, and I'm gonna just do a sketchy doodle. I am gonna do this whole page here. I'm gonna go around twice or three times. I'm obviously not staying in the lines, I'm being very messy about it. I'm going to zoom in a little bit. There we go. And then I'm going to just, I'm not, I'm just making some doodles, some marks, something that's interesting. Maybe a particular shape comes to your mind, and so then you want to doodle that shape. Think of it as a frame for what you're going to put on here, whether you're going to collage cards or you're going to put pieces. Remember how last month we did our sun and we also did our, I did the orange slice. So something that when you add your journaling and you add your other bits and pieces is going to add to the complete picture. So we're going to just do a frame. Yeah. And I don't think I'm done with the black pen yet. So I'm going to take my white pen and of course I'm filming so there goes the computer <laughs> of course everything starts digging as soon as I'm busy now you could do this with a white paint pen if you have one I like the white gel pen for something like this because I have a little bit more control in the little tiny spaces and sometimes I just want to do this. And sometimes I want to just do this. Yeah. And 
then I'm going to take my purple pen and sorry, purple crayon. It's really like a sheer transparent crayon because it's a highlighter. And then my gold pen. Oh, this is the brand new one. Hang on, let me get the other one. Because you don't want to sit here and watch me prime a paint pen for five minutes, do you? <laughs> so we already have these gold um, embellishments here because of the washi tape. So I thought it would be good to maybe bring in this paint, some more gold over here. I love this Krylon paint pen. I, t I spoke about it last month. It's like my favorite thing. Something easy, something quick. It doesn't have to be complicated. Just sit and doodle in your journal. Create a, an interesting, fun, cute space to do your writing in or your pasting if you're doing it more of a, a smash journaling, smash booking kind of a thing to paste your bits and pieces in. It doesn't have to be, you know, we're not looking to be Picasso here, right? So something just like that, that's all I need, that's all I want. It's got little touches of the gold in there. I love that. It's a perfect pay place for me to do my writing and write about what this prompt really means to me and to go out and intentionally do something, like I said, if you spend a lot of time doing for yourself, then I want you to step out of your box and I want you to do for others. If you do for others constantly and you constantly are forgetting and neglecting yourself, stop doing that. <laughs> and I want you to go out and I want you to find something special to do just for you. Yes? All right. That's it for today. If you want to join the Facebook group um, where we explore our journaling in a year and we share different ideas and methods and I they, that's where you get the free downloads and stuff like that. The link is in the video description down below if you're watching this here on YouTube along with my happy mail address, a link to um, a site where you can get all of my different links across the internet, um, including my Etsy shop, my website, my LinkedIn even is on there. Um, so check out the video description. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And above all, go out and do something nice for yourself. Maybe somebody, somebody else too, because you deserve it and so do they. That's it for today, everybody. I will talk to you later. Bye, guys.